Hi, so this is one of my earlier glass blowing machines, and this is kind of a primary and secondary operation machine, and that can be set up with automated attachments such as slitting saws, automated marvers and burners and for secondary and finishing operations, or it can be used just as a full functioning glass lathe for general purpose use and prefab. Uh, it has two independently controlled chucks that can be manually controlled uh, with this hand controller I made or interfaced with my PC for CNC operation. Uh, the tailstock is also automated through computer control so like here I just assigned some uh, keys on the keyboard for movement and I can jog uh, the tailstock in and out with the keyboard control or I could even write a program and automate a procedure uh, very simply and then of course there's always the hand wheel. You know, so this particular model does not have a pass-through bore so there's some limitations on what can be chucked up and uh, there's a simple pressure system that passes pressure to a pip that comes out the center of the spindle. And so to chuck something up uh, for pressure a stopper is just placed in the end uh, with a short pip and uh, insert into the chuck and a quick turn uh, mates the, uh, the two pips and the seal is made. And uh, here we can see that it's uh, very well centered indeed. And this controller is pretty straightforward. Um, it's really a signal generator that provides the necessary control signal for uh, the motion amplifiers. And then we come over to the power supply. Uh, I built and designed this using a high-powered toroidal core transformer that has multiple taps and then a little simple DC rectifying and filtering network. Um, so yeah, this machine actually runs on DC. Uh, you can actually hook this up to two car batteries and operate this for days. Um, and uh, you throw it in your trailer and bring it around uh, uh, since it doesn't weigh 2,000 pounds, it weighs uh, just short of 200 pounds. Um, so, uh, and it's a very precise machine. Well, that's really about it for the basics. So, if you have any questions, I'd love to hear them. Please comment, and thanks for looking. Oh, and also, I build custom machines, like glass lathes, thermal crack-off machines, cold working equipment, foot pedal controllers, manifolds, torches, and... If you can dream it, I can build it. A lot of loose objects making chatter. <laughs>